Hi everyone, my name is Mike Mello, broker associate and owner at Preferred Real Estate Brokers. Today we're in St. Cloud, Florida in a community called Ellington Place by Ashton Woods. We're only five minutes away from a brand new public schedule to open really soon. 10 minutes away from Lake Nono with lots of other restaurants and shopping, including Walmart, Sam's and Lowe's. We're 20 minutes away from the Orlando International Airport, 30 minutes away from downtown Orlando, 35 minutes away from Disney or Universal Studios, and about 50 minutes away from Port Canaveral and the East Coast beaches. We're gonna show you this home behind me. It is a four bedroom, three bathroom home with 2,043 square feet of living with a base price of $429,000. They do have an inventory one of this available for $459,990. So let's talk a little bit about the outside of the home. The one thing that you'll notice right away is that there is no garage here. That's because they have a two car rear entry garage in the back that we'll show you as we tour the home. So as we come up, we have the sidewalk that goes throughout the neighborhood and then a walking path up to the front of the house. As we come up, we have a really nice covered patio area where you can put a couple chairs out, enjoy the beautiful Florida weather, say hi to your neighbors. And we have the door right in front of us. So let's go ahead and go inside and check out this home. So welcome into this home. Let me go ahead and close the door behind me. As soon as I walk in, I notice the ceramic tile that goes throughout the first floor. Over to my left, our stairs going to the second floor. We'll show you later. Behind here is the pantry that we'll also show you just in a little bit. But as we come back, what we have is our main living area of the house, which is the kitchen, the dining area, and also the family room. So let's talk about the kitchen first. The kitchen has this beautiful center island, which is really large for this size home. We have the two pendant lights coming down from the ceiling and three seats. So you have plenty of space to sit here and enjoy a nice morning cup of coffee. Behind me is the side-by-side -side refrigerator. So you have that space to put all your cold goods. And if you need a little space, we have, of course, the cabinets, but if you need some extra space, the pantry is right behind here. So let me go ahead and open that up and show you the pantry right now. So as you can see, you have plenty of space for all your dry goods. So let's go ahead and take a tour of the rest of the kitchen. So as we come into the kitchen, with the center island, we have the dark browns, which go contrast really nice with the beige colors that go with all the cabinets around the outer side of the kitchen with a beautiful backsplash going throughout. We have our range and microwave and plenty of storage for all your dishes on the center island in that dark brown color with the sink, beautiful faucet, and also the dishwasher. So behind me is the dining area. The dining area is currently set up for six people to sit around a round table. We have plenty of light here of a window on the side, and of course the French door is going out to the backyard. We'll, we'll go out there in a second and show you with the light fixture coming down from the ceiling. Behind me is the large family room. So you have plenty of space here. You can put a sectional here if you are into having a nice sectional. TV on the wall, light fixture coming down. Definitely plenty of space with a couple of windows on your side for natural light if you want it so in the daytime. Behind this door is the two car garage. So let me open that up and show you what we have behind there. So you have plenty of space for the two car garage and they do have a little bit of space on either side of the garage. So you have that space to open those garage doors that some of these homes don't really give you. So let's go ahead and go through these French doors and show you what we have outside. The only structural upgrade that they have for this specific home is this patio. So currently, this is a standard patio that you get when you purchase the home, where it ends right here. Now, if you wanted to, you could extend the patio all the way down to the end of the garage, which would be here. So a much, much larger patio where you can have some chairs and tables and enjoy you know, a nice evening with the beautiful Florida weather like we have today. And as we come through, I'm gonna show you what we have on this side, because being we didn't have a garage on the front, we have plenty of space here to park plenty of cars. So this specific lot, has this really long driveway and the two car garage. So you can fit plenty of cars here, especially for a four bedroom, three bathroom house. Uh, lots and lots of space for all your cars. So I do like that. So follow me this direction, we'll go back inside the house. And the community is really beautiful with all the natural landscaping going throughout. And as we come back through, we'll go up into the house. If you haven't done already, make sure you like and subscribe to our videos. We definitely appreciate that. And then we'll come through here to the left and show you bedroom number two and the full bathroom. So behind this door is gonna be the linen closet. So you have places for your towel and also linens. Um, behind me is the door going to the full bathroom. The full bathroom has this really beautiful tile on the floor. Haley really liked it. Haley's my daughter who's filming us today. Uh, and we have uh, the brown cabinet, solid surface countertops, mirror, light fixture, and then behind us the shower with the tile going all the way up to the ceiling. So to the right is gonna be bedroom number two. It's currently being used as an office. So I have the desk and the bookshelves, so the light fixture coming down, a couple windows looking out 
onto the yard and behind me a closet. So if you didn't want to use it for a bedroom, you have that space or you can use it as an office and store some paperwork in there if you wanted to. So follow me this direction. Now, if you are looking to buy a home here in the state of Florida, make sure you give me a call. My name is Mike. My phone number is 407-487-3030. You can call or text anytime. I'll be more than happy to help you with your home search journey. But let's go ahead and go upstairs and show you the second floor. Welcome to the second floor of this home. So as I come up here, the first thing we have is a little area to the right with the window. So you can put a little chair here, a little desk, whatever you want, or leave it empty like it is right now. So let's go ahead and go and show you bedroom number three. So bedroom number three, you've got the bed end table on your side. It has some nice paint on the wall, two windows looking out in the yard. And then behind me, we do have a closet. Let me open that up. And you can see you have a normal size closet behind the door. So follow me this direction. We'll go ahead and go right next door, which will be bedroom number four. So bedroom number four has a bed, a couple end tables, a window looking out in the side yard, and it has the same closet design that we saw in the other two bedrooms. Right across the hallway is gonna be a bathroom, so follow me over to the bathroom. So as we go over there, the first thing we have, we have a couple things behind here, is the air handler. So you have that there, but on the other side is your washer and dryer. So if I open this up, you get to see where the washer and dryer is nice and convenient between all the upstairs bedrooms. And then behind that is going to be a full bathroom. The bathroom has the white cabinet, solid surface countertop, sink, mirror, light fixture, toilet, and also the tub with the really beautiful gray tile going all the way up to the ceiling. So next stop is the primary bedroom, which is right behind this door. So follow me this direction. And we go to this. This is a very spacious primary bedroom, especially for this size house. King size bed and table on your side. I like the windows. We have three windows for lots of natural light, especially on a beautiful day like today. You have your light fixture coming down from the center and over to the right is going to be the bathroom. So let's go ahead. We move from the carpet to this really cool tile design in the bathroom with the beige cabinet, solid service countertops, dual sinks, mirror light fixture over to my left is going to be a really nice walk-in shower with the tile going all the way up to the ceiling. Behind the door right next to it is gonna be the water closet. So you have that for nice and private. And then we have our main closet, which is plenty of space for two people to have. Um, unless you have a lot of clothes, you should, this should be plenty of space. And of course you can make this a custom closet by ordering those online and making it your own. So that is the end of the tour of this specific house. If you want more information about this house, make sure you give me a call. Again, my name is Mike. My phone number is 407-487-3030. You call or text anytime. And of course, I hope to meet some of you soon. Take care. Bye-bye.